What an opening chess trap! For today's video, we will analyze the game between the blind player and sighted player that happened in the tournament. Arjo, the blind player, used an opening trap against sighted player. Unfortunately, the sighted player fell into it. So let's go and analyze. So playing white is Arjo, the blind player, and playing black is the sighted player. E4, C5, Sicilia, knight F3, knight C6. And here, Arjo went to move um, C3. The idea, of course, after D4, C takes, C takes. White will have a very strong, a very intact um, center pawn, knight F6 by black. And the pawn is under attack, so Arjo decided, let's go with bishop to d3 the idea is after bishop d3 bishop c2 and we'll continue the d to the d4 d6 by black castling bishop to g4 h3 bishop h5 rook to e1 development of course one of the ideas is later on if um white can push the e4 to e5 that would be pretty good for white however black early of the game committed a blunder that would give um white a piece up knight to e5 and can you spot the next move of our blind player here you may pause the video if you're ready let's go knight takes e5 actually i was behind them i was at the back and watching and i i heard the way they converse the sighted player told arjo hey your queen is free. Like, I'm gonna capture your queen. And Ar Arjo said, um, Yeah, that's okay. I'm giving it away. And then, the, si the sighted player captures the queen. Arjo turned his head and smiled. Like, <laughs> he couldn't hold himself. But, yes, this is a trap. My trap was a success because bishop b5. Knight to d7, capture, queen is forced, captures. As you can see, this bishop, if move away, the knight will capture. If king captures, rook takes bishop, it's a piece up for white. So, study opening to avoid falling into any kind of chess opening trap. Study the principle, the theory, at least the basics. And I hope you learn something from this kind of chess opening trap. 